Today was our final serious underway. We went out for something called a nav practical, navigation practical. All the navigators had a little piece of the navigation brief and we were flawless. I mean, we nailed it perfectly. The instructors had nothing to say at the end. It was very refreshing. Big weight lifted off our shoulders because we, we've been basically chewed up this entire class. I got inspired to make my chart look kind of cool, but it didn't turn out so good. It turned out really like frilly. I consider this the perfect chart, guys. We have sea monsters, Mark and Showwater. I tried to make monsters as well, but those monsters were not so well done. I'm not an artist. It's perfect. I've done quartermaster practicals and navigation practicals before, but there was nothing like this one. Our instructor said, Bring your chart and get to this point. They took an engineer patient who hadn't really looked at anything navigation wise and they said, you're the navigator for today's evolution. They made Kyle the navigator, he was driver. So that's called getting fragged. We didn't get fragged because I was lead navigator for the event. For our practical, we went out with no radar a chart and seamen's eyes. We had to figure out where the heck we were going based on the territory around us. So navigating by seamen's eye, you have to find characteristics on land and then basically triangulate your position. When there was nothing to steer at or go towards, my boat captain would look at a cloud formation, pick out something on the cloud and then steer towards that. It's pretty cool. I'd never seen that before. and. He'd just kind of look over my track. I'm like, yeah, I think so. Yeah, you look great, you know. And he's going off a cloud. The cloud obviously would move and he would pick something else out, like another cloud. Weird. It's pretty interesting stuff. We did really well. We got to our destination. One boat was a little bit early, but we'll work on the fine tuning in our next class. We took a written exam as well. Everybody passed that. So our testing is done. Thank goodness. We just have one more evolution to go. We have to pack up the boats, wash them down, make sure they're good to go. And then we're going to bring them to North Carolina, four hours away. And we're going to go shoot guns. It's been a wild time. It's almost done. We're gonna go eat some crab tonight again. I'm gonna miss Virginia. I don't know if I'll come back anytime soon, but I like it here. This trip has been an absolute blast. Learned a ton and got to see a whole bunch of stuff and do a whole bunch of things that I've never done before. In DC, man, DC alone, you need like a month there to see everything. I told some of the instructors that I went to DC this weekend, they're like, did you see this, this, this? And I was like, no, I didn't, I didn't see all that. So, I'll have to go back there too. <sighs> okay, everybody. Have a great day. Thank you for watching.